this morning I'm making um, something that I don't know if anybody else has ever made it but um, this is a blueberry waffle sandwich that I will be making so follow along with me and we'll make it together I need um, two eggs for this recipe I have some ham right here you can use turkey ham or whatever kind you prefer um, you're going to need some non-stick stick spray to spray a bowl because we're going to do the eggs in the microwave. Um, we're taking a shortcut this morning. Um, of course, your toasted and ready waffles. We're going to be putting on some American cheese and some mayo because that's the way I like it. So follow along and we'll do it together. So let's get the eggs going first. And we're going to spray the bowl with non-stick spray for the um, eggs. And go ahead and crack your egg into the bowl. And we're gonna do both of them at the same time. You can do one at a time, but we're gonna go ahead and do them both. You can add salt and pepper, whatever you prefer, on your eggs right now. And get yourself one of these microwave safe plates and cover because the yolk may splatter in your microwave and you don't want that. So we're going to go ahead and put them in like this, covered for one minute. All right, they're going. While that's going, we're gonna go ahead and go to during our ham. So, so we're frying up the ham a little bit just till it starts to sizzle on both sides. You hear those eggs popping in there? When the ham starts to shrink up just a little bit like this one, see how it's bubbling up a little bit? Then we're gonna take them out now. They're ready. Let's assemble the sandwich. I hope you can see everything pretty good. So I'm gonna start off. We're gonna put some whatever cheese you like, but I'm using American cheese slices. And I like <coughs> excuse me lots of cheese so we're gonna put cheese on both sides and gonna put the mayo on so let's just get that on there on one side or however much mayo you like. And yes, I'm putting it on top of the cheese because that's how I like it. Okay, so got that. Now let's put the ham on there. For the eggs look at how they came out kind of perfect huh in one minute and your eggs are done I used butter um, non-stick spray but you can use any kind I actually prefer coconut but I ran out of the coconut non-stick spray so I used the butter because that, that's all I had so Cover it. And you can use bacon if you prefer, but I didn't want any bacon this morning. All right, so it's almost done. Look at how pretty that is. It's almost done. I'm going to stick it in the mic for 30 seconds 
just to get the cheese melted a little bit more and I'll show you what it looks like. So I added some fresh fruit, some nectarines. They're so, so good. Oh my gosh. And some fresh blueberries. And um, I'm not a chef, but I am a home cook. And this is what a home cooked breakfast looks like. I hope you will try this very easy, fast recipe for your breakfast during the week when you're rushing to get to work or to school. It's really fast. You can prepare the fruit overnight, um, the, the night before, have it already cut up and ready, washed and clean. And um, this ham, I mean, it takes less than a minute to um, cook. The eggs were one minute in the microwave. And uh, you have your breakfast in less than five minutes. And uh, this sandwich, if you bought it at McDonald's, you probably pay $5 for it. 